Hello Glamours and welcome back to my channel and if you are new to my channel thank you so much for stopping by now don't forget to click on the subscribe button and that notification bell for more upcoming DIY future videos. For this DIY, I'll be creating an entryway table using cardboard, crushed glass, and loose pearls. If you would like to find out what I created, just continue watching. For the first DIY, I'll be working on the tabletop. To start off, I'll be starting off with a trifle board. This trifle board is very strong, as you can see in the video, and I'll be splitting it in half by the seam by using my box cutter. For the remainder of this DIY, I'll be using my strongest glue sticks. Next, I'll take the part that flaps open and I'll glue them together. I'll have a complete list of all items used in the description bar below. And now it's very thick and it feels like wood. I added weight on top until completely dry. Once it was dry, I covered one side with mirror reflection paper. I also cover the edges with double strips of self-adhesive mini mosaic stickers. And don't forget to follow me on my social media platforms linked below. For the second DIY, I'll be working on the table base. So I took a sheet of packing cardboard and I placed it in a horizontal position and then I took my long ruler and I'll draw two straight lines on each end and then I took them and cut them with a box cutter. Next I took a large hula hoop and I'll only be using one side and I'll draw a half circle on both sides. Once I have both half circles I'll be cutting them out using a box cutter. And I cut out two of the same size. Next I took a few pieces of cardboard and I cut them to size and some of them I'll be rolling and some of them I'll just fold in half and I'll be using these as fillers for my base. Once I have all my pieces I'll just start gluing them in place and this will make the base very strong and it will hold up to 25 pounds. Once that was done, I'll apply hot glue on top of the fillers and then I'll glue on my second cutout. Once that was done, I apply one coat of school glue on each side and then after drying, I apply one coat of metallic silver on both sides. Next I took foam board and I'll be placing 6 inch markings and then I'll be cutting 3 strips in a horizontal position. Once I was done, I covered all three with mirror reflection paper. Next, I took all three and my X-Acto knife and my ruler and I'll be cutting quarter inch grooves on all three. If you decide to recreate this, just keep in mind not to cut too deep or you will split the board. Once I was done, I just started bending it where the grooves are just to give it flexibility. Once that was done, I'll start gluing them on the edges of the base. I repeated the same steps on both sides. Next I took two foam boards and I cut them to size for the top and bottom part of the base and then I glued them on.
Next, I took clear school glue and a brush and I started applying a generous amount and then I spread it out. Once that was done, I'll be applying clear crushed glass and I'll keep repeating the same steps almost to the center. And to give the crushed glass that extra sparkle, I'll be applying silver glitter as I go. And just for FYI, I repeated all the same steps on one side because this table will be flushed onto the wall. I'll be repeating the same steps on the lower part and I'll leave the center empty. In the center area, I'll start off by applying a generous amount of school glue. Once I apply the school glue, then I'll sprinkle it with glitter. Once I was done with the glitter, I'll be applying loose pearls. And around the crushed glass area, I'll be giving it an ombre effect. I let it dry overnight and the next day I went back with the pearls and crushed glass and glitter and retouched areas that needed it. And here is the finished look. I really do love the way this table turned out and what I love the most is the pearls in the center and the crushed glass around it. This is a very budget friendly DIY and with the proper placement and lighting, this table will be a showstopper. This entryway table will look stunning in any hallway as soon as you open the front door. This will be the first thing that will catch your eye. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this DIY as much as I enjoy creating it. Now don't forget, I post new DIY videos every week. Like and share with family and friends and subscribe if you haven't. Comment if you wish. Turn on your notification bells for my upcoming future videos. I'll see you on my next DIY upload.